Ladies and gentlemen, let's go ahead and talk about Ye. But first, let me go ahead and give the lore for the people that are out the loop, the, the very few people. I, I doubt there's actually people out there that have no idea what's going on. But for that rare occasion, let me go ahead and let you guys know. The artist formerly known as Kanye West drops this tweet right here. And since anti-Semitism is cringe AF, this led to him getting banned off of Twitter, losing both of his positions at Adidas and Balenciaga. And after him getting cut at both of these positions, that dropped his value from a billion dollars to just a mere measly millions of dollars now he's been going on this press run he's been on the news he's been on podcasts and that's what i want to talk about here i want to go ahead and just talk about this one podcast alex's uh johnson's podcast where he said some very um intriguing stuff i'm not gonna lie to you guys i didn't really want to talk about kanye west because i feel like everything he does is just for pub i feel like he's just gonna he's doing all of this because he's about to drop something because that's just been a, a, a common trend that he's been doing with these type of outbursts so i just been avoiding talking i'm like he's just wanting a attention he's doing this for for a reason but boys i don't i don't think he's dropping anything after this everything everybody is cutting ties with this man a whole bank cut ties with this man so i don't think he's dropping anything so i feel like he is from the bottom of his heart believes what he's uttering out so i just want to talk about this once and for all and just go ahead and just give you guys my thoughts and opinions on a few of the comments he said on this particular podcast let's go ahead and talk about the prominent uh comment that he said that's been circulating around the interwebs that's right you're not hitler you're not a Nazi. You don't deserve to be called that and demonized. Well, I I see I I see good things about Hitler. Also, the I'm sorry. What? Jew. I love everyone, and Jewish people are not going to tell me you can love, um, you know, us. Huh? And you can love what we're doing to you with the contracts. And you can love what we're, you know, what we're pushing with the pornography. But what? this guy what? that invented highways, invented the very microphone that I use as a musician, you can't what? say out loud that this person ever did anything good. And I'm done with that. I'm done with the classifications. Every human being has something of value that they brought to the table. Maybe Kanye, the God-fearing man that he is, the Christian, the devoted Christian he is, is just trying to look on the bright side of an individual instead of focusing on the bad. You know, I, I can respect it. Maybe not in this scenario, to say the least, if you're talking about Hitler trying to fight the good of Hitler, but in the grand scheme of things, you know what? I can respect it. Do I round up Jews in Nazi Germany? Do I get love then? Schwarzenegger said he loved Hitler. They gave him an award. I, I'm just saying, I don't like Nazis, and I don't like what some of the mafias are doing either. I like Hitler. Oh. Like Kanye, bro, man. I loved you, man. I loved you. You dropped my favorite album of all time. I even got the vinyl for it. Hold on. Let me show you guys one second, bro. Y'all, look, look. I got the My Dark Twisted Fantasy vinyl, bro. This is my favorite album of all time, bro. Like, this costs some bread, too. Some cheddar. And just the fact that I'm seeing Kanye West just crumble right in front of my eyes like this, man, is just sickening, bro. Am I necessarily surprised he's saying this type? Type of uh edge lord stuff no because he has a tendency of doing this just spiraling out of control but oh i didn't expect it to go like this far where you're, you're backing hitler you're backing up hitler now man come on it's crazy like alex jones was giving him a lab right this man was throwing up a lob like yo man you're not hitler bro like you're not doing anything crazy it's not like you you're bringing up a second holocaust bro like you're just saying comments am i right yeah like you're not hitler and this man mr west just straight up brandon knights this lab and just yeah. says that Hitler fellow, he, he's pretty swag if you ask me. That man is straight pog champ. That's gonna be one of the worst missed layups I've seen in my life. And I saw what Russell Westbrook played last year. Like y'all y'all know that meme where everybody just in unison just is I think that meme right there just perfectly describes how everyone felt when they heard that. And the outrageous comments don't stop there, ladies and gentlemen. I got another one for you. Oh my goodness. Just because you don't like one group doesn't mean the other. But look, I fine. love Jewish people, but I also love Nazis. <laughs> oh man well i have to disagree with that the edge lord himself alex jones is straight laughing because he's like nah bro you wildin you the king edge lord himself is saying you wildin bro you gotta reevaluate yourself kanye alex jones is looking at you and laughing in disbelief like i don't i don't think it's possible to like jewish people but also like nazis like imagine if someone was sitting up there it was like yo man no no like i really rock with black people like rap music is my thing i dig it man and Let's do, but I'm not gonna lie to y'all, man. The Ku Klux Klan, man, they, they got some 
values over there, man. I, I watch those people as well. Like, nah, buddy, nah, man. You gotta pick. You gotta pick a side, bro. You're not gonna be on this side over here. Still rocking with the clan? Like, what kind of backwards logic is that, man? You can't like. You can't rock with the Jews, but also like the people that are trying to wipe them off the earth. And ladies and gentlemen, I just want to say that that's not even the worst part. He not only says that he rocks with the Nazis, he also says he is a Nazi as well. <laughs> Like, I, I'm tired of hearing I'm a Nazi. I'm really sick, I'm not. But I think by them falsely I, accusing I, people, some people are going to become Nazis. I, I am. I am. <coughs> now what? I am. You're now what? what? Now, I'm a Nazi, Ari Emanuel. Isn't that- Isn't it kind of crazy that this is the same man that said, and I quote, I hate these fellows more than the Nazis? Hey man, you either die a hero or you live long enough to see yourself as a villain. Which, by the way, top five Kanye song for me, man. For, like, top three, top two even. Again, you should be using Alex Jones as a compass. Alex Jones is like, yo, I don't even want to be associated with Nazis, man. Like, I am not one of them. But no, Kanye just blatantly ignores it. He's like, no, I'm one of them. Nah, that's me. That They, they really mean for real yo i i know kanye fans are just straight punch in the air right now we can't keep defending him he can't keep doing this like i've never seen a downward spiral this bad since game of thrones disclaimer i've never seen game of thrones but i've just heard everybody talking about how it gets worse towards the end so i mean hopefully hopefully i hit on that joke but yeah man he also says another outrageous stuff he also says that he's pro putin and russia in terms of ukraine and russia i haven't really seen so much of that in the news i'm of course pro putin i'm very pro russia um, you know, I am also. Let's go. Yeah. Um, you know, you see that this is just an extension of the United States neocon establishment, New World Order type stuff. Kanye, you're agreeing with Nick Fuentes. You're agreeing. You're side by side with Nick Fuentes. Yo, man, take off that mask because it is blinding you, man. How do you not see this? Hey, I'm, I'm not going to say nothing bad about Putin because you never know what happened in the future. And that man's cut through. He might pull up this video say, hey, man, you, you was talking real reckless in this video right here, man. You see this video right here? Well, like, what do you mean by this? Hey, man, you never know, man. So I I ain't gonna say nothing, but come on, come on. Pro Putin, like Kanye is losing his mind. I want you guys to look at this clip. Uh, just, just go ahead and look at this clip. Perfect answer for the ADL. They are gonna have to listen up. What we did is we brought Netanyahu with us. Ah. <laughs> I mean, is, I'm in the twilight zone right now. Netanyahu, what do you have to say? What do you have to say to Alex Jones right now, Nick Fuentes and Ye? It was bad. It was bad for Trump to meet with Nick and Ye. Okay. I had no idea your voice is gonna sound like that, Netanyahu. For the people that have no idea what they just watched, basically, he was imitating the leader of Israel, who, whose last name is Netanyahu. Yeah, you see that clever wordplay he did right there? He had a Netanyahu. He still got it. So yeah, when I saw that clip, I'm like, yo, Kanye is for real losing it, bro. He's having another uh, manic moment. Can I say manic? Can I say that this is a manic moment he's having right now? Y'all gotta think about this for a second, man. The, mo the most sane person in that set right now is a person that owes a billion dollars to Sandy Hook victim, all due to the fact that he was just spreading misinformation about it. Y'all see why I wanted to talk about this now, man? Like, this is this is insanity. Okay, this next video I'm gonna show you guys is f basically just for the few people, the few Kanye fans are still trying to stand by him. When I heard this, um, it, kind, it kind of turned me off of Kanye. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. I, I like Hitler. I, I don't like Hitler. And I know you're trying to be shocking with that. I'm not trying to be shocking. I like Hitler. I do not. I The, the Holocaust is not what happened let's look at the facts of that and hitler has a lot of redeeming qualities Kanye west really sounds like the edgy kid that gets called out for trying to be edgy but he's he's already like too deep in so he has to commit to the whole entire bit here's the second part of the of, of the video it's like he had a really cool outfit and stuff and he was a really good architect and uh and so you're in love with the with the with the with the, with the architect the, 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 the look of it and he didn't kill six million jews that's just like factually incorrect guys yeah, so get the ronald reagan clip they showed me yesterday and you see how quick alex jones cut him off so he wouldn't finish that sta uh, statement because alex jones no when you say stuff like that it could get you in a world of trouble you saying six million people didn't die from the holocaust is factually incorrect the holocaust is a very very well documented tragedy in the world's history like where are you getting your stats from that's what i want to know where did you get that notion from who have you been talking to who are in your circle man do you have some nazis in your circles that we have to worry about oh yeah you've been hanging around nick fuentes lately yeah you definitely have some nazis in your circle Kanye, oh, yeah, man you need to so surround yourself with better people man that's that's all i gotta say you gotta surround yourself with better people because the people that you are with are definitely not helping 
helping you out whatsoever. But hey, that's all I gotta say. Let me know down in the comments below your thoughts, opinions on this whole thing, uh, as well as a like and a sub. My camera's about to die, so uh, hopefully I see you guys in my next one, and hopefully Ye finally betters himself and stops saying this type of nonsense. Bye. Bye-bye.